Now, what's going on? It's Scrip. And recently with COVID-19 and stuff, <clears throat> it can be quite hard to get your cigars and stuff. Well, I found it difficult anyway. I mean, I could go um, to my local tobaccoist and get them delivered and stuff, but it's just like when I buy a few cigars, it's like, what's the point? There are some stuff from the shop. When I was in Stoke on the way back up to Edinburgh, um, guess what they sold for nine quid for a pack of five? In Morrison's, they sold a uh, Rio Six. You know those. Um, I, I'm really liking in Sainsbury's in UK. They sell um, um, the Cuban box pressed um, Villinger. They're quite nice. So I've got two samples here today. Got some moments. <coughs> I used to be a huge disliker of Café Cremes. Or they're called Signature now. But I think Moments are a little bit nicer. So we'll start with the Moments and then we'll move on to the slightly better one. And then I'll tell you about something which I think is a home run. Right, so these are... You get 10, you could get 20 packs of these. They're not expensive. I think this was about four pounds something, like closer to five pounds, but four pounds something. And if we take a look at the tobacco, it's actually got quite a nice sandy color. It's not. I've had quite a few cigars in the past that have had, you know, the little green dots and stuff. So they're basically just cigar cigarettes, really. But nice, you know, if you need a nice little hit of tobacco. I mean, I'm. Back to my vaping again now, but uh, of course I can't go without a cigar. Like once you're in that world, it's very hard to. <laughs> now, Henry Winterman's. I'm liking these a lot. They do a pack for about eleven pound something, closer to twelve pounds. Cause, <coughs> sorry. Yeah, they do a pack called the Half Coronas, and they're really decent size. You get five in a pack for about six pounds something, and they really do fill the purpose. So this is a, uh, sorry, I can't read that I'm in one of these moods, sorry, I had a heavy night last night. Uh, corona. Sumatra. So we'll open that up. I've already taken the cellophane type wrap off. <clears throat> Try and be careful of this because this is my only proper cigar for the day. So we got the band, which is quite nice. Henry Winterman's. And smell wise. It's got a nice, um, sweet, um, sandy tobacco smell. You know that sandy tobacco smell. Um, very light and um, but rich at the same time. I do like smoking these. The ash burns white. And do you know what? For £5 something, I think they're £5.80 something and as the... You can't go wrong with these. Yes, I, I do like being able to cut my own cigars, but yeah, like <clears throat> I'm trying to get you a bit of size. Here's a mask. That's the size. It's a Corona. So I'd say it's about four and a half to five inches. Um, ring gauge, I would say it's about what, um, <clears throat> 38 or something like that, maybe 36, you know, something somewhere in that region. 
I mean, this band slips about everywhere, but actually, actually talks quite in quite nicely there. Um, flavor wise, as I said before, it's a nice flavor. It's really worth the money, I would say. Um, the local tobaccoist, um, Johnny's Tobaccoist, hit them up in Newquay. If you need your cigars, Johnny's Tobaccoist is the place. And the Jez who works in there, he's a sound geezer. He'll help you out with any questions you have. And they do have some good stuff in there, like I got a few Rocky Patels and stuff in there. I get, they have the um, acid crush line. Um, and they do have um, Kahiba and stuff like that, Kahiba shorts and, oh yeah, Cigaleros as well. <clears throat> and they are currently open from 11 a.m. till I think it's 5 or 5.30 p.m. So if you're coming down to Newquay and you need something, you've got these at Asda, and you've got the packs of five of half Corona, Henry Winterman's. Obviously, if you're on a tighter budget, you've got the moments, you can buy them in packs of 10 or 20. I do prefer these over the signature. That's just a preference. Or if you're going to get signature, get the blue ones, I would say. I think the uh, the you know the yellow ones I never knew what the difference was but I think they're a bit lighter the uh, yellow ones. Anyway, I'll wrap this up but <clears throat> honestly oh I'll let you in a dirty little secret actually. If you go to um what's that really nice supermarket um uh come to me waitrose they actually have i bullshit you not tubes of monte cristo for about 14 pounds they have the villager and they also have um romeo and julieta and i couldn't believe it i i went to hospital because the nearest hospital big hospitals in Truro and um, I was very ill one day and this was months ago and uh, when I left my mum was like oh we'll get you some cigars I was like oh fantastic and yeah I couldn't believe it I rang them up and said what cigar selection have you got and they said oh we've got a Monte Cristo I was like Monte Cristo and they were like yes and I was like, oh, fantastic. I ended up getting the Villager in the end, but it is an option. Uh, but yeah, out of 10, I would rank the Henry Winterman uh, Corona Sumatra. I would give it a good 6 out of 10 for the price, availability, and taste and barn nice white ash these out of 10 giving their just little you know signature style mini cigars i'd give these a good five out of ten thank you for watching anyway i will post some more videos soon i'm gonna get right back into the cigar um, thing again I ordered lots of um, Drew Estate cigars the other day well actually it was a, f a few a, a couple of months ago but I should have done a video um, if you want one more look at this Henry Winterman um, made in the EU Corona Sumatra, but the half Coronas, as I said before, five in a pack for about six pounds something. 
really good. They're about half the size of them. And you get five in the pack. And they really do hit the spot. But anyway, thank you for watching. And more videos to come.